Hey, this is Jerome Chiaro here with Restaurant Management University, and uh, today I want to talk to you a little bit about social media. So, designed this segment called my Social Media Game Plan, and I'm going to go through some big strategies on how to build the social media platform for your restaurant and really get a nice following. So, there's a few uh, great techniques here. I'm going to start with the context though and tell you a little bit about. Um, what I use my secret formula for social media so I have social media SM equals 75 percent relationship and 25 percent promotion what this means is for every three out of four posts that you do or tweets or Facebook uh, pictures you put up three of them should be a uh, relationship based so something uh, that's gonna benefit your followers your customers something that they're gonna like it could be something funny uh, it could be something a link to uh, to some other web page that they might enjoy but something to build the relationships so that they like you and they trust you and that they're getting something some kind of benefit from being your friend or being uh, in the in the follower of your section and then the other 25 percent one out of every four uh, posts that you do is going to be promotion based sales based so this is very important that your context is that the uh, the whole social media platform your whole marketing campaign needs to be relationship based not just promotions hammering away at your your customers so i want to start with that context for you and um first thing I want to talk about is Facebook of course if you don't have a Facebook page yet for your restaurant you're missing out on a lot of free marketing Facebook is one of the biggest social media platforms you've probably heard about it already but um, it, it's free to tap into and a lot of restaurants are having wild success with this so I outlined a couple steps here on what you can do to get your Facebook started and it's actually free there's a little bit of work involved but again you can outsource a lot of this which is nice um, first step is create a fan page there's a big difference between a fan page and a Facebook page uh, Facebook allows you to create an actual business page for your business for your restaurant so you can create a fan page and uh, offer an opt-in box with an email address you can offer um, you know different little contests and coupon codes and all kinds of things but the the main goal here is to get your customers to click the like there's a little like box and if you're familiar with Facebook you know what I'm talking about but if you're not it's a little uh, thumbs up like box and you want to get your customers to like you and uh, what's nice about the fan page is you can get tens of thousands of people to like you whereas a regular Facebook page I believe it you can only get up to uh, 5,000 or something like that but these sound like a lot of big numbers but the point is that um, you want to build your likes eventually get a nice base of your customers following you because the power of Facebook is that there's um, it's kind of exponential so every time you post something on Facebook not only will your all of your friends or all of your fans see it but all of their friends will too and they'll be interested and they might click through and uh, click to your fan page get your coupon or whatever you're offering so it's pretty pretty powerful when you think about it so even if you only have a hundred two hundred three hundred uh, fans to start it's actually a lot more people actually viewing your page so getting your customers to like you one strategy I like to use, I'll just give you a couple quick ones here, is um, using a, a kind of some kind of coupon, maybe a free appetizer or some kind of incentive to come into your restaurant. And in order to get that coupon, they need to click the like box first. So you know, get my free, get our free appetizer for this, and you can have some pictures and promotions there. Click the like button, they click it, and then they're able to print out the coupon. So that's very easy to set up, and it's a great way to start building your customer base and getting those uh, like buttons clicked and then the other thing is to post and comment on other people's it could be other restaurants in your area their websites or some of your uh, customers as well too but you just want to stay involved in the social scene the more you're out there posting and commenting uh, the more people see your restaurants name and your name if you're the chef especially and they'll click your name check out your information in your restaurant and subscribe to your uh, fan page as well too so a little bit about Facebook 
book, there's some great strategies I go through in my restaurant marketing blueprint detailing uh, how to build a, a social media platform and especially how to outsource a lot of this stuff because it sounds uh, time consuming and it can be. Uh, so you definitely need to do some outsourcing here. But um, in this next video, I'm going to go into Twitter a little bit, which is huge, huge in the restaurant business right now, and how to use some of those strategies and my final uh, secret on how to use social media to blow up your restaurant.